Okie dokie. Hello. Welcome back, if you already know who I am. If you don't, hello. <laughs> I'm Zara. And today, we've got a little bit of a different video. Never done this before, but I want to do an Amazon wishlist unboxing. I never really share this, but I put it on my community tab the other day and I posted that I have an Amazon wishlist, so I posted a link and no one knew about it and now people are sending me gifts and stuff and it's crazy. I can't fathom that I share a link with someone on the internet and people appreciate my content enough that they actually send physical items to my house and then I unbox it as a bit of like a thank you filming a video to thank you guys and show you some of the things that I've got in the post. It's very exciting. First thing, this came the other day and I've been really wanting to open it. Yes! Oh my god! <gasps> the Faber-Castell Polychromos. Oh my god, these colour pencils. These have been on my wish list for so long. They've been on like my birthday and Christmas wish list for like two years. I've never splurged and bought myself them. Oh my gosh. Because they're super expensive. This is the 24 pack. I think it's one of the smaller ones you can get, which makes me feel better because hopefully it wasn't too expensive. You guys, this is insane. I do not feel validated <laughs> to receive this stuff, but I'm so grateful. I feel like I look really bald today. I really hate my hair. I really want to cut my hair. Oh, no. Ignore it. Look at all the colours. Oh my gosh. I can't wait to test these out. I'm gonna test them out and then insert a couple clips here. They're really, really vibrant. Like the colours just, it just goes down on the paper really nicely. I can't believe how good they are. They're gonna be really good for my RA level because I'm actually working with watercolour and coloured pencil. So they came at the absolute perfect time. So thank you to whoever sent these. An annoying thing about Amazon at the minute is I get things off my wish list and they come in packaging. So I know it's from Amazon and I know it's off my wish list because I didn't order it and this was definitely on my wish list. But something Amazon used to do was they used to come with these little gift tickets that it said the name on and people could leave a note. Amazon don't do them anymore, so I have no idea who send me things. It doesn't have a name, it doesn't have a receipt or anything. It just shows up and it's just the product. So I have no idea who sent me these things, but I'm so grateful. And thank you. <laughs> I used to enjoy getting the little notes because people could write something. It was kind of interesting. Package number two. I feel like I don't recognize myself today because I'm wearing no eyeliner. When have you guys ever seen me with no eyeliner? Ever? <laughs> Ooh, I know what this is. Circular and Co. Oh, these are really cool. I've been wanting to try one of these for a while because my current flasks are kind of crap. I mean, they keep my drinks really warm but I can't do the lid up on them because it then the pressure builds and it literally like explodes. But this, it's sealed when it's up and then you push it down and you can drink from anywhere so it's not one specific side. Leak proof. Oh, I love it. And it's also recycled so it's very environmentally friendly. Which, that's really cool. I'm gonna have to test that out because I'm having a lot of teas at the minute. Okay, next package, we're gonna have to change angle because it's big. Hula hoops. <laughs> I don't know how else to open this apart from just rip. Ta-da! I look less bald now, I had to change the hair. <laughs> this probably seems really, really random, and it is, but these are on my wish list because I need them for an art project. I think I'm gonna probably keep whichever is the middle sized one this one. I'll keep this one and maybe we'll hula hoop. That is way harder than I remember. I'm gonna learn. I actually need them for my art project. I do art A level and I need something to hang kind of like a chandelier like this and then I've got things that I'm hanging off it. I'm doing a big installation so these are gonna be painted and used for my art A level final piece which is gonna be in an exhibition. I have one more package for today. I have no idea what this one is, but it's heavy and in my porch. I'm gonna go grab it. I don't even think I can lift it, it's huge. Oh my god. Oh my god. I can't explain how heavy this is, holy shit. Oh, I'm dead. This is a never before seen angle. 
You're gonna have to ignore the mess in the background. I was not prepared for this video. Okay, this is the best angle we're gonna get. Oh my God. Wait, if this is what I think it is, then this is a big gift. Whoever sent this, you're crazy, dude. What? Oh, it's like Christmas. Oh my God. Oh my God, I've wanted one of these since I was like seven years old. Oh my God. The bag, holy shit. It's sunny today. Oh my God, oh my God, I can use it. I can set this up right now because it's really sunny out. It's the perfect day. This, this is an air track. It's so heavy. I don't know if you guys know, but I do gymnastics and I've always loved gymnastics since I was little. And there's these things called air tracks, which are basically like a really long inflatable, like bouncy mattress, I guess. And it's called an air track. And you can like practice flips on it. It's really safe and spongy. So it's the perfect thing for practicing gymnastics at home. And I've always wanted one, but they're quite expensive. And I wasn't sure whether I had the space to store it and stuff. So I put it on my Amazon wish list as like, it, it was kind of a joke. Like I didn't think anyone would get it because it's quite a big gift. Oh my God. Oh, this is crazy. I really wish it told me a name. I don't know who got it. Okay, it comes with a pump. That's definitely handy. Air pump. Oh no. I don't know what these are. Maybe that's a fix it if it like rips. I'm gonna keep those. Okay, I'm gonna go get my mom. Get a space set up in the garden and I'm gonna test it out. But this is gonna take a bit of setting up so I will be back. Oh my God. That's so cool. Can we set it up? The footage isn't gonna be of me doing really cool flips like I wish it was because I'm still recovering from my shoulder injury. The injury is healed, but I'm really, really weak on that shoulder, so I still can't put much impact on it. So no walkovers, no handsprings, no backflips, but I'm working back up to that. So soon, very soon, hopefully in summer, I will be doing more gymnastics videos. And now that I can learn from home on my air track and actually be safe doing it, there's gonna be a lot of gymnastics content coming. Maybe I'll have to do some videos where I try and get a certain skill and I give myself like a month. That could be cool. <laughs> but yes, the air track, I really like it. 10 out of 10, best thing ever. I should have bought one a long time ago. <laughs> but thankfully, someone gifted it, so I don't have to go and buy it. <laughs> That's absolutely crazy, oh my gosh. I love you so much. The rest of this footage is just my stretching routine because as I've still got a little bit of a sore shoulder and I'm building up the strength, I can't properly <laughs> practice my walkovers or any of my cool tricks that I really, really want to get better. But I thought I'd include this anyway because this is my stretching routine that I do pretty much every day. I've somehow managed to keep my splits. So I've got them down fully on my right side, but then my bad side, my left, as you can see in this video, isn't quite down. It's just me in pain. <laughs> And I also tried to do some headstands, which I'm ridiculously bad at. I don't know whether it was more difficult because I was on a mat. I really enjoyed stretching. I find it so relaxing <laughs> and it really helps me like ground myself. So anytime I'm feeling stressed or really anxious or I feel my tics getting bad, enjoy the rest of the video. I was just in the middle of setting my air track up and three more packages came. This one's got a gift thing. Or maybe this will have a name in it. Yeah, that's got a note. I think it's only if they choose gift wrapping then it gives me a note. Oh, ooh, this feels, this feels like a book. I think it's an optional thing, so the other ones must have been anonymous. Mark Manson is my favorite author. I can recommend all his works from Eric. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's, that's so cool. Yeah, he wrote the subtle art of not giving a fuck. <laughs> Ooh, 
Oh, I put the other loop earplugs on there because I, I have the quiet ones, which are really good. For, they block out everything. But if someone talks to me, I'm like, huh? But these are like the in-between ones. These are the college variants. Loop engage. So these will be good for in class because people always talk to me and I can't respond and it's really awkward. Ooh. Ah, oh, yes. And they're the clear ones. They're clear with black. So they've got black so they don't get dirty, but then the loop bit's clear so you, you can't even see them. Oh, that's really good. Oh, they're amazing. You can't even see them. Oh, they're really good. Gift from Zachary. Zachary Davis. Thank you. Oh my gosh. Oh, this is the massive set. Okay, so I, I had two sets of polychromos on there. And this is the this is the big tin set. Someone else got me the small set and this has all different it has all the different colours in. The tin of in betweeny shades. Oh my gosh! So now I've got like all of them because I've got the two different sets. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh that's got that's got so many greens, so that's gonna be good for my garden. Matching sketch pad. I know, that's crazy. I can do my um my book on that. I just want to say thank you guys so 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 freaking much. This is obviously a very extra thing. I don't expect anybody to give back. I don't expect anybody to buy me things, but it is a nice extra way that I've got available in case people do want to send stuff, they want to say a thank you, in case people do have, you know, the extra funds and they feel like it. I don't really share the link a lot because it's not what my channel's about but I did want to make this video just to say thank you. It's crazy. And it's probably interesting to see me unbox some cool things. Thank you so much. Thank you for watching my content. Literally just liking, subscribing, commenting, just watching the video is enough. That means a lot to me. A an extra special, oh my God, thank you <laughs> to the people who have sent me this stuff. It's crazy. I love you all. <laughs> and I will see you next week. Sunday, Sunday 5 p.m. Every single week, my neighbor's looking at me. Hello. I hope you have a lovely, lovely day. I hope you enjoyed the video and have a lovely day. I can't even speak, I'm literally speechless. Have a lovely day. Bye. <laughs>